name is Isaiah, and I will be telling you about Roald Dahl, the famous children's book author. Roald Dahl was born September 13, 1960 in Wales. Wales borders England and is part of Great Britain. When Roald was a boy, he was amazed at what his father could do without his arm, which he lost in an accident. Shortly after Roald turned three, his sister Ashby, at the age of seven, died. A few months after Ashby's death, his father died of grief. When Roald grew older, he had a delight for candy. When he was at his boarding school, he loved the candy store nearby, but disliked the clerk greatly, and snuck a dead rat into the candy jar and returned to school. When in one of his classes, the clerk told the teacher the boys suspected. Roald was with four other children when he pulled the prank, and each boy got caned. Roald was taken out of the school after his mother heard of the caning. When he was older, he got a job at an oil company and killed a black mamba with a hockey stick in one of his trips to Africa. He fought in World War II and became a war hero. He met Walt Disney and tried to make a movie. It didn't work. He was invited to the White House and made adult short stories. He married Patricia Neal, age 27, when he was 37. In 1955, his daughter Olivia was born. In 1957, his daughter Tessa was born. In 1960, his son Theo was born. When Olivia was age seven, she died of rare kind of measles. And in 1965, Pat got a stroke and was in a coma for three weeks. Pat got divorced in 1983 and he married Pat's friend Lissy in the same year. He owned many antique shops with his children. His last published work was Matilda and he died November 23rd, 1990 after he was diagnosed with a rare blood disease. Because of Roald Dahl, many kids today actually read because of his books. Most of Roald Dahl's books were turned into bestsellers. One of his books is based off his World War II adventure. I hope you like this podcast about Roald Dahl and learn many things about him. Thank you for listening to this podcast about Roald Dahl. I hope you like it and see more of my projects. Bye!